this is Joanna. Welcome to my channel. Today is another Tuesday Thoughts video where I talk about three products I like and use and why I like them, how I use them. They're usually products you've already heard about, so it's going to be like a snooze fest. Zzz. But I'm going to tell you my thoughts about them, and that's why you're going to watch, right? Okie dokie. Let's begin with product number one. I have everything over here on the side. That's why I'm looking at it, and I'm leaning to get it. Number one is the Clinique Moisture Surge. I always have difficulty saying it. And it, this is the, um, what's it called? The Extended Thirst Relief. Now, this has been discontinued. This claimed that it gave you a 12-hour moisturization, hydration, which it does. Like, if you feel that your skin is dry and it has uh, little cracks and stuff, you put this on, it gets more smooth. This does wonders for me, and I have dry, sensitive skin. I really, really like it. It's like a gel consistency, and it is very nice and fresh. When you put it on, your skin sucks it up very, very quickly. So um, you don't have to wait. It's not like sticky. It's not greasy. It's like putting on water. Now this has been replaced by the 72 hour extended moisture surge or something like that with 72 hours, which has aloe water. And it's going to be the next thing I buy when I finish this one. It claims then the 72 hour one claims, of course, to provide hydration for 20, 72 hours. And it has aloe water, which is always good for your skin. So yeah, I thought I'd give this a mention because if you have not tried it and you suffer with dry skin and patches and all that, and you want your skin to look nice and smooth, you should get it. I have it under my uh, foundation now and I just love the way it feels and looks. So I strongly recommend it. Let's move on to product number two. Two. Let's move on. Product number two, a sponge. Now, I was always a brush girl. I used brushes all the time. I really liked them. I had a big collection, but I did start using a sponge, which I now understand. I don't use it for loads of things. I use it only to apply my foundation. And you're going to see a clip of me applying my foundation with it later on after I talk, show you. So I have the Real Techniques uh, sponge and it's got a tip, it's round and it's got this straight section. This section is for contouring. I don't use it for that. This section is to apply makeup. This section is to go for hard corners. So I use this for the inner corner of my eye and for my concealer. For my foundation, I use the um, rounded bit. Now, does it absorb product? Yes, it does, but not too, too much. And when you wet it, you're supposed to use this wet, not dry. You put it under the sink and it absorbs water and it becomes bigger. You just dab, dab, dab. That's how you're supposed to apply it. It's smooth. If you have difficulty with your eyesight, I think this is a good option because you feel where you're putting the makeup. You just have to be very conscious that it goes everywhere. And I am, I've been converted. I don't apply my foundation, I don't apply my foundation with a brush anymore. So that's number two. I'll show you a clip of me applying it now. So I'm using the sponge now. I'm going to apply my makeup on my skin. I'm using the Clinique Beyond Perfecting, um, foundation and concealer it's a two-in-one I like this the thing I don't like about it is that I don't know where I am like is it close to the end has it almost finished hmm. who knows so I just apply a bit all over my face and the areas where it tends to go away and then I use my sponge so this is my sponge it's a real techniques one 
and it has a point at the top and a straight area at the bottom and I just dab 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 as I mentioned in my intro and yeah that's about it dab 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 I put it everywhere and I always forget my corners uh, in the eye and it's the top bit here is really good for that just to go to your corner you know eyes closed of course you don't want the sponge to be in your um, eye of course so yeah and under the eye I use it for my concealer just to brighten up that's where the point comes again good and just in the inner corner always right number three is my Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Bronzer I have the medium deep bronze and it's a matte bronzer I use this to contour and you're going to see me uh, see a clip after the, I talk about this um, I like it. It is about how many? It is uh, 10 grams and I've had this for ages. It comes with a nice big mirror which is always good. I'm not going to show you but this is how big the mirror is. All this is mirror. All this is a mirror and it's a good mirror actually and um, I still I've been using this for ages and I still haven't hit pan. I use today the Smashbox contouring brush. I usually use my Lottie brush, but because I washed it, I couldn't use it today. So, this is the Too Faced. I think this is about uh, 24 pounds. I forgot to mention the Moisture Surge is about 24 pounds. And the Beauty sponges are around 5 pounds, 6 pounds, depending on what you're buying. You can buy cheaper ones. I don't know how well they work. But you can get cheaper ones as well. So you're going to see me applying that now. And this is the Too Faced Cocoa in medium deep. And I'm using my Smashbox contouring brush. I'm just going to put a little bit at the top of my brush and go from the top here like that and on the other side sharp corner just a bit more so I have two corner two lines and now I'm going to blend that so upwards it blends easily I haven't really used this before so just a bit of a blend and then I put a little bit at the top. I don't like having like a lot of um, bronze on my face. Although this is more to contour. So, yeah, that's it. That's how it blends. I might put a little bit more on. There you have it. My three Tuesday thoughts. Beauty sponge, moisture surge. Too Faced. Hope you like this video. Let me know if you use these products, how they work for you. Don't forget to subscribe. It would be amazing. I'm trying to grow. And yeah, I need all the support. So yeah, thanks for watching. Have a lovely day and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.